Are you guys tired of seeing your lights being this dim in game and the graphics just don't look as good as you'd like them even if you crank them all the way up? Like you see how the lights are, there's no reflection. It's just the lights that look so dull and ugly. Well, that's what we're going to fix in today's video. Hello everybody, Trooperhorn23 here, and today we're going to be installing Make Visuals Great Again. This mod is going to increase your graphics, and it also um, will make your police lights much brighter and much more um, spectacular, I guess is the word. So today all we're going to need is this file right here, Make Visuals Great Again. The link will be in the description. It's going to bring you to this page. This is going to get annoying because you can't download it unless you are logged in so you're gonna have to go over here and hit sign up and this got quite annoying for me just make a random display name email address password for password and then click opt out of providing security answers because these just get annoying and they've all got to be different and it's just going to delay you so just hit opt out of security answers and then confirm your email and once you're there you can click the link in the description and you'll be able to download make visuals great again and you can look at the pictures if you want. It's going to make your graphics look amazing. I mean, look, if you show me this picture, I wouldn't be able to tell you if this is real or fake, like a game or not. It's amazing. So once you got that downloaded, drag it out to your desktop. You can go ahead and open that folder. And it's going to have a folder, Make Visuals Great Again, inside of it as well. Open that. And we're going to have Optionals, Manual Install, Automatic Install in the README. Just go ahead and click on the Automatic Install folder here. And it's going to have a .oiv. If you watched my Kiflom video yesterday, then this is the exact same process. Just go ahead and drag this OIV file out to your desktop like that. It's going to look like a blank piece of paper. Open OpenIV. Hit yeah, Grand Theft Auto 5 for Windows, of course. I honestly have not even looked at these Optionals. Taxi... Oh... Um, I need to do that myself, actually, the taxi sign fix, reshade and EMB. I've never done any of these, but I'll look into it. So once you're in open IV, go ahead and go into edit mode, like always, and you should be in your main directory. Go ahead and go up to tools, and then package installer right under ASI manager. Click on package installer, and then find your .oiv. If you dragged it out to your desktop, go over here and select desktop. And you'll see it right here. Make visuals great again. Click on it and hit open. And it's going to bring this up. Hit install. Now remember guys, never ever install anything into your game folder. Always click the mods folder. If you install into your game folder, it's going to mess up your game. So hit mods folder. Hit the install right here at the bottom. And wait for it to finish. It may take some time, it shouldn't take more than 30 seconds though. There we go, installation succeeded. You can go ahead and close that, close OpenIV, and delete this .oiv. And we're ready to go in game, so I'll see you there. Before we go in game guys, don't forget that I do have a Discord called Trooperhorns LSPDFR support slash hangout. You can hop in here to just talk with other people, and me included, I'm usually on all the time. And you can talk to other people that play LSPDFR, um, if you have any issues with LSPDFR, I also have help channels and helpers that will um, attempt to solve your issues. I can even help you as well, because like I just said, I'm on almost all the time. We're also running down the list of my mods. We did all these in a previous video. We're on Make Visuals Great Again here. And in future videos, we're going to have these right here and the Realism Enhancement mod. So feel free to join my Discord. Let's go ahead and hop on in-game. And once you're in-game, we can go ahead and go to a nearest police station. And once we're in here, we can go ahead and go on duty and select one of your cars. I'm going to select the one that I had in the intro because it's got the most lights. It'll show you the most. Police garage. And here's my car that I use. It's one of my favorite cars. It's got all the lights. So once you're in game, you're going to immediately notice that the graphics look phenomenal in my opinion. They just, it looks so much better than the default. And if you turn on your lights, look at how much brighter they are. They look so much better. I can even change the time to night. And just look at the reflections off everything. The lights aren't just dull 
and look ugly. So that's going to do it for today's video. Um, I hope you enjoyed. I hope you installed Make Visuals Great again. If you have any issues, feel free to join my Discord. Keep an outlook for future videos. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and have a good day.